Hi, welcome to Kindred Spirit Readings. Let's begin Virgo. So there are a couple of things happening this week. You're finally, if you haven't already done this, coming to the realization that things are not what they seem. And it might be hitting really hard, Virgo. It might be doing one of, this could, it can do one of two things here because what I'm picking up on is that it's either going to make you perhaps unintentionally react to a situation in terms of how you've been feeling, what this has been doing to you past and present. There's a lot of confusion. There's more confusion now than ever before. And you might be now finally prepared to walk away. And even even though I'm going to point this out and make this really obvious here, because what I'm seeing is that it, it may be that you don't want to walk away because you still have hope. You're still hopeful. You're still wanting something that you perhaps cannot have, but you don't know enough about this to invest your time and effort into it. Now, what I am picking up on is another person. I'm seeing somebody here who this is about, and it's just been tearing away. I believe that you fought for this relationship before. You've done this many times before. I feel that now it's getting to a point where you don't know what to do anymore because you just don't have all the facts or you don't have anything to sort of go by. Um, and, and so much more is attached to this. There is, there is that. And I will say this, however, there is a lot going on behind the scenes and I don't feel that you have much access. And even if you do have a certain way around this to be able to gain clarity or to be able to reach out to this person, I do strongly feel that it is you, you want to be able to do this and be appropriate about it. And I feel that what is going to come from this is that you might choose to stand back and just allow things to flow naturally. I do feel that this other person wants to reach out to you, wants to talk to you. There is a conversation coming, not for a while though, but there is a conversation showing up here. And it's going to be quite interesting to sort of peel back the layers, if you will. There are, they're quick to come in, uh, in terms of, they know what to say, but they're being rather strategic about it at the same time. It's very, you know, all in, all in your head kind of energy and both of you might be mirroring each other i'm seeing two people here that really have an attraction towards one another there's definitely love definitely love and there is lust and there's a whole lot more that is connected to this but i feel you might you might be really holding on to your last breath hypothetically speaking this is you saying to yourself well i'm not really sure about what more i can do to prove my point um I've been in for a while, a long time, and this other person simply doesn't want to speak. At least that's what I feel is coming in from your end. Let's talk about your money, Virgo, because there's a couple of things here that we need to clean up this mess. There needs to be, you need to be acknowledging what's going on here, of what you're actually doing. And you could be hurting your pocket more than, than not. Spendings are going wild. I don't know what went wrong there. Something's sort of out of whack with you in regards to your finances. I feel that you've gone out of your way, whether it's because you haven't felt too good, you could be spending money for no reason. You could be inviting friends over, spending money on your friends or yourself. You could be purchasing things that you simply don't need, but it is a way to distract yourself from your reality. And your your reality is what is staring you in the face and, and what has been bothering you is what is damaging potentially this could become more than what it is right now we need to fix this we need to stop spending we need to start paying ourselves back so if you can come up with a plan this week to do just that then you will have no issue whatsoever and you'll be back where you need to be you'll put yourself uh in a, you'll have yourself you know standing sitting whatever the case may be in a better place you know that by the end of october we might be back on track all over again this is really startling to, to even see this sort of how it's all unfolded don't use your money as a way to distract yourself from something else that you perhaps didn't know how to resolve we need to focus we need to stand by our decisions and we need to be able to make those solid decisions yes even if it hurts even if you have to shut something down um and don't let that be your money if you know that something isn't working out for you, whether it's emotional, uh, it could be emotional, you've got to be able to try and work on yourself um, emotionally, physically, whatever that may be for you. But I feel that this has been an issue that's been playing on your emotions and you've just, I, I, I keep seeing that you've spent your money, a lot of money, and that really hasn't helped. 
I can tell you now I'm looking at a couple of thousand dollars that you spent in the space of one to two weeks. Easy. And sure, you were having fun, you were enjoying purchasing things, but that's not the answer. Now, I want to move on to a couple of other things. You're working on yourself this week, uh, so that is a great way to begin the week. It's going to be about you, you know, about self-reflecting, trying to find a way out of anything that is sort of stopping you in your path. And I feel that you're almost there. You're getting to a point where you're finally realizing what you need to do. So this all turns out for the better. This is great. This is success. Also, I, you know, for those of you who are somewhat involved with Libra, I don't feel that this person is doing you any favors whatsoever. This relationship with Libra is, it's sketchy. I don't feel that you trust this person after everything the two of you have been through, but something tells me that you saw something coming and I feel that this may turn into a very messy legal battle and there are people walking away from each other. You could be walking away from Libra after all that has been said and done. And believe me, there are going to be a lot of things that are going to be said and done. Have you had any trust towards this individual? Slowly but surely, that's going down the drain. Thank you, Virgo.